grilled cheese. So, I'll uh, chill get set up here. No, it's not today. <sighs> so, we have here cheese, my little buddy. Well, we were buddies. I don't know what happened to our relationship. Yeah, we're not, I don't know, cheese. We're not like we used to be. We have to make things right. So, cheese. Cheese is an Angolan coral cobra who's absolutely out of his mind. He's very handsome, but as I've said many times, cheese changed. I don't know, maybe he went through puberty. He was so nice, and now he's not. All he wants to do is kill me. He just wants to bite me, and they're pretty toxic, these guys. I have a feeling, especially this one. Especially this one, when he's in a mood. Yeah, you, you get moods. You're pretty moody for cheese. Come here a second. Oops. The trick with these guys, it always comes down to one thing, which is like to have the right angle. You know, you don't want to be in front of them, of course. You want to be where they have to most turn to get to you. All right, so it buys you a little bit of extra time. So cheese <laughs> is highly motivated to get to me. And so if you're in front, you're behind. All right. If they're behind, you're in front. So you can always sort of hold them if you really want to. You know, but with this guy, he's a little acrobat. Okay. So <laughs> he's got a prehensile tail, which is funny for desert dwelling creatures. But, look, cheese is a lot of cheese, what can I tell you? And he's making an eight, so play that number, eight. Cheese says play eight in Lotto today, and he's making one to prove it. You see, he's not making a nine, he's saying lock in number eight. All right, if you can't trust cheese, who can you trust? Eight. Thank you for that. He's also saying that today he, he ate. He ate? He ate. You good? Okay, I got you. I got you. Just, just, just thank you, Jesus.